Hi, my name's Warren Palmer and I hope to be your wedding photographer for your big wedding day. I'm going to talk you through your wedding day and how it relates to how we do your photography. I would usually arrive one hour before the ceremony to wherever you were getting ready to take some photographs of the last stages of preparation. Afterwards, I will either go to the church or down to the ceremony room to find the groom who will be looking suitably nervous. I will take some photographs of himself, the ushers and all the guests as they start to arrive. Once your guests have all settled down, I will wait outside for you to arrive and take some photographs as you sweep them majestically into the ceremony room or church. Depending on the vicar or the registrar, I will usually wait at the back of the room or church to take some photographs during the ceremony without flash. This ensures that I do not disturb the ceremony itself. Once the ceremony is over, we would usually all go outside where I would give your guests 10 minutes to give you a hug, give you a kiss and let them take their own photographs. Afterwards, I will arrange the group shots. I always have a list of the group shots that you are after with me. And from this, I organise the group shots of your family and friends. After the group photographs, we would disappear for half an hour to get some photographs of the two of you. This is a great time to relax, and we always get some great photographs. Once your individual photographs are done, you return back to your guests and I go into reportage mode. This means that I hang back and take photographs as they occur. These are all light shots. Detail shots are the little things that really help make your big day. I'll also make sure that I get some detail shots of the decorations, the location and the wedding cake. As your guests begin to sit down for the wedding breakfast, I will again take some reportage photographs of everybody as they start to come in and sit down. I will also take photographs of the two of you as you sweep in to the wedding breakfast and sit down with your guests. While you're eating your wedding breakfast, I will take a break and keep out of the way. If you have ordered one of the options that includes the speeches and even the first dance, I will come back when the speeches start and I will of course photograph your first dance. As soon as I get back to the studio, all the photographs get downloaded onto the computer and go through an editing process. The first thing you will see is a selection of photographs that have been uploaded to the gallery area on my website. For this you will need a username and password and a client code and I only give the client code to the bride and groom to ensure that you see your photographs first. You will next receive a DVD of all the photographs I took on the day. These are high resolution and they are not watermarked. From this DVD you select which images you would like to go into your album. You send me the list of the images and I will design an album using a graphics package. Producing the album usually takes three to four weeks once you have signed off the design. So that is just a short description of how the wedding photography might go on your big day. In this video I can only give you a very simple guide as to how your wedding photography might progress. For further details please call me or go to www.wjbphoto.co.uk